that's too low or something. Um, no, that's actually pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay. Oh, boy. <clears throat> I'm scared. on the left that's all the way down and that's just gonna be a big nope from me dog we're gonna we're gonna turn it up because I'm a giant baby okay yeah dude this is my first time ever playing it uh, by the way howdy Ziggy great to see you here buddy um, yeah, it's my first time ever playing it, and I'm a giant baby, so this is gonna be, yeah. Monsters are still creepy, but can't kill you. Don't need to worry about stealth. Or monsters are dangerous and can kill you. Uh, I mean, I figure I should probably play it the way it was meant to be played, and then if I keep fucking it up, we'll go to safe play. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. It's true. I am. Wifey knows. But this is for the kids. It's okay. I got this. I have the lights on. It's okay. Reality is that which, when you stop believing in it, doesn't go away. Are you okay, Simon? I think you're bleeding. Oh, that, that's nothing. It's just my brain can't stop bleeding from the accident. Here, take this. No, that, that's for later, for the scan. It's green. Ashley, I need to tell you something. Simon, please don't make this weird. No, no, it's not like that. Why now? Who's David Lynch? Uh, don't worry, Ziggy. On, never enough time? Uh, on Wednesday. On Wednesday, um, I'm going to be having mood lighting and everything for this game, so don't worry. <laughs> Christ. Oh god, that phone vibra vibrating is in my game. Okay. Yeah, I'm up. Jesus. Hi, Simon Jarrett? Yeah, that's me. My name is David Munchie. We spoke earlier. The brain scan. I remember. Are you alright? Yeah, yeah, just a bad dream. Are, are we still on for today? Yeah, that's why I'm calling. I wanted to remind you to drink the tracer fluid I sent you. It'll help me capture a better image of the damages. Don't worry, I, I, I got it somewhere. Okay, great. Well, see you in a couple of hours then. Okay, see you soon. Okay, now, I've heard that this game doesn't really get creepy until about a, a little after two hours in. Um, I don't think we're going to end up getting to two hours here tonight. You working this weekend or what? I knew there was something you were doing. Was it this weekend or next? Anywho, just shoot me a mail or something. Love you, miss you, mean it. End of messages. <laughs> I swear, that guy has the memory of a goldfish. I even sent an email to remind him, didn't I? What does that say? Uh... Oh, I can see... Volterra on the bottom. I can read the rest of it. Where did I put the tracer fluid? Um, okay, let's see. Cinema variety. Massive recoil to flawless execution. Come on, radioactive tracer fluid, where are you? Well, soon love mom. Now, 
<laughs> I like it. They're just gonna fucking throw it. <laughs> As for the Neurograph session, the scan will be performed at the Pace Laboratories in Toronto. Since we are guests, our access is a bit unpredictable. I'll try to schedule a scan session for Saturday. I'll get back to you when confirmed. Let's see, new prescription. Happy to hear your headaches become less frequent. Your latest tests show your brain is slowly recovering, but it's still too early to tell how well it will adjust to the damage. The bleeding will continue over the coming months, at least, and you will need to come to the hospital a few times to drain the cavity to prevent the blood from building up pressure. Oh, good, my brain is bleeding. Awesome. Uh, since excessive stress could be fatal, I have written you a prescription for Prozosin to help you with your nightmares. Please read the instructions and medicate accordingly. Try to get a lot of rest. I will see you next week. Jesus, that's kind of horrifying. Oh, okay. I forgot to hit send. Let's see. Uh, hi, Jesse. Since you probably forgot, here's me reminding you that I've got the doctor's appointment tomorrow. I am not coming into work. This means you need to make sure you're actually on time to open up the store and please unpack the boxes behind the counter. They are starting to become a workplace hazard. Also, books tend to sell much better if they are put on shelves where people are able to actually see them. Good luck. You'll need it. Jesus! That's kind of rude. Better late than never. <laughs> Better late than never. Dude, she's at work now, probably. Summer's coming. Well, that's cool. Hope it's a good one. I like that. A lot of interactivity in this. That's going to take some getting used to. Is this it? That looks like shaving cream. Oh, there's my shower. I was like, do I not have a shower? Let's see. No spoilers, but hope you like crippling depression and sadness. I mean, the story of my life, buddy. Now, I did have the ending of this spoiled for me at one point, um, but it's been a while, so I'm not sure if I actually remember it. So I'm not going to say anything, and please nobody else say anything. It feels like milk, but the taste is like sucking on a penny. <laughs> God, gross. It like feels like food. milk. But the taste is like anything. sucking on a penny. The paste. That's... I am a little terrified to ask what the paste is. Jesse the Grim. Jesse. Hey, Simon. I got your email. Just wanted to wish you good luck and let you know I got you covered. Thanks. I should be able to come to the store after the scan. Don't sweat it. I got Matt and Chris help me out. Matty from SNL? Uh, guess you didn't hear. He's coming in full time, working the comic section. That's Ashley's job. Yeah. Well, you know. Forget it. Not doing her any favors by leaving an empty spot. Not like she's coming back. Well, good luck. Hope they find a way to reverse the whole, you know, dying thing. <laughs> dying thing? Yeah, You're the it? worst support ever. <laughs> what should I say? I'll see you later, Jesse. Don't burn the place down while I'm gone. Over and out, buddy. <clears throat> Two seconds, guys. Me in a
Hello? Dr. Munchie? Where is everyone? Thought this place would be busy. Okay, I'm back, guys. Let's... Oh, where are you? I've got a few hours. I got a whole bit of Simon Jarrett. Let's do this. I saw your laptop in reception. Are you already here? Get your stuff ready. Uh, hi, Paul. I, ta I talked to Pace about using the lab this week. I managed to book the scanner for tomorrow morning and again on Friday. It's not a lot, but they said we could use the empty reception area as a kind of office. It would allow us to use their computers to run models, and also if a time slot opens up, we can get in there and use the scanner rig right away. I thought we could run some tests tomorrow. We could do a scan of each other to learn the equipment. It's supposed to be pretty easy. On Friday, I'm hoping Dr. Aaron Peake will send somebody over. She has a patient that was recently in a car crash. Should be interesting. Okay, so it looks like I'm the patient that was in a car crash. We're locked out. I found some extra time in the lab today. Unfortunately, nobody told us about the code change, so I called security. Talked to Professor Way to have him vouch for our project and finally got a hold of some honcho over at Pace's legal department that could re-grant us permission to use the lab. I'm not allowed to repeat the code in mails or texts, but I'll leave a note or something in case we forget. Okay, so there should be a note somewhere for the code. I mean, that's that's what I'm hearing. I kind of like that this stuff just free flows. Like, that's kind of cool. the doctors, alright. I wonder, can I like... No? Okay. Well, that was worth Let's see. What's this? Okay. Can't read those. Okay. Turn on the lights in here. That painting reminds me of the one in the resort. If you haven't seen the resort on Peacock, it's pretty interesting. The first episode didn't really grab me, but it got really good. I'm halfway through. There's eight episodes. Um, yeah, yeah, I'd, I'd recommend checking it out. Peacock is like five bucks a month to watch with ads. All right, so he said he would leave a note. Nothing on the voicemail. Oh, come on, there we go. All right. This is the place, right? It must be. Let's just call Machi real quick. Here we go. Fred. He'll probably tell us where it's at. His phone turned off. Oh. That's okay. Or he's out. busy and can't do anything. Okay. I can crouch. Good. What is that? There's something back there. Okay. Said he would leave a note or something. Crouch. Okay. I mean, oh, it does not bode well if I can't even solve this puzzle.
I'll leave a note somewhere. Okay, he'll leave a note somewhere. That uh, I see no notes. Uh, I'm. Am I really this dumb? to do with the rope or up there up there dude what? how am I not getting this I can't give up yet left trigger is sprint oh my god there's a waste paper basket in here Oh. Okay. Seriously? I mean... Let's try the classic. I feel really stupid right now, let me tell you. You are in this to see Hocus Pocus 2 yet? My wife is really wanting to see it. Yeah, um, like wife said, we did watch it the other night. Um, it was decent. It was. I and mean, it's not the original, of course, but it's decent. There's another waste paper. you're empty too. Yeah. Son. I already checked in the drawers and I didn't see anything. There's nothing in there. There's this, but there's no hints or anything. Um, and there's this journal. That's, that's all. Wow, this really does not bode well for my, me not being able to solve this simple puzzle. This does not bode well. Guys, please feel free to point out where the letter or where the note is if you know. Um, and feel free to mock me for being this dumb. Dr. Munchie? Can you hear me? Hello? I've talked to you, can't agree if it's good or bad. No, that's fair. I mean, like I said, it's it's definitely not the original. But for what it is, it's good. You know? I know we need a code. Let's try the rooms. 361. 362. Oh. It's not the room numbers. I thought for sure. This dongle would do it. Nope. <sighs> Is 
the notebook. I checked the notebook in the desk drawer. Check this. I see two five and then a symbol. I, I don't, I don't know if that's like two five zero triangle. That's what it looks like. Five zero one. There's no way that's a. There's no way that is a one. It's not a zero. That's fucking weird ass math symbol. Everybody knows it. Hey, the idiot did it with the help of chat. like a fun room for me to mess around in. Oh, hi. Didn't hear you come in. Simon Jarrett, right? Dr. Munchie? Well, it's uh, just Mr. Munchie, but I'm working on it. <laughs> Actually, you're helping me right now. Is this part of your thesis work? Yeah. It's a study I'm doing with my colleague, Paul Berg. We hope to design a gentle way to work with brain reconstruction to help people like you. Oh, did you uh, take the tracer fluid? Yes. Yes, I did. Great. Well, we can start whenever you're ready. <clears throat> so... What exactly are we doing? We're going to do a scan of your brain. Then we build a computer model of it and bombard it with stimuli. The program will help us to quickly iterate your treatment plan until it's fully optimized. In short, develop the perfect treatment for your condition. So it's not just a study. This will actually help me. I should hope so. Otherwise, this would be a huge waste of time. <laughs> Turn the closed captions on to you, just for people that might you know, have, have their serious sound all the way condition, stuff. right? You heard about the car crash, the X months to live deal? Yes, I heard. Must be hard having to hear that. As you know, it's because your brain is weakened so much that it can start to bleed every so often. And if it ever gets real bad, it will kill me. Well, we probably can't restore your brain completely, but we should be able to make those X months turn into years, decades even. If you take care of yourself and don't do anything too crazy, we should be able to get you to outlive the best of us. I really hope you're right about this. Me too. This could make a huge difference for how we treat people with brain damage. So, what do you say? Should we get going? Sure. Let's get started. Take a seat. Here we go. Guys, yeah, I'm gonna be posting my extra life links in the chat here while this cutscene plays. Um, guys, if you can, please, please, please donate right. or at the very Let least spread the these way. around, okay? You are Simon Jarrett, correct? Right. Toronto, Canada, David Munchie. Born 1988, July 16th. Right. Flat neurograph, version 6. Good. All files in order. Will this hurt? It's just a scan. It'll hurt about as much as getting your picture taken. Indians thought cameras would steal their souls. Does that sound? Well, let's hope they're wrong. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Say cheese.
that's probably not good. What happened? Hello? Mr. Munchie? Did something go wrong? Oh boy. That's blood. This, this is isn't funny. Destroyed now. I, I'm not supposed to put myself in. This is kind of stressing me out. How did I get here? God, I could feel that vision change. Oh. Is there Omni tool to access? Omni tool somewhere, probably. Let's see. That looks like it might be important. Set it there for now. Let's see. Automated unlock terminal from service console. Okay. See if I can at least outsmart myself from last time, because that was pathetic. I don't think this has anything to do with anything. I need an Omni tool. I just like, do I need to like activate something on here? What? <laughs> I got it. There was no Omni tool except a fire extinguisher. I call that an Omni tool. You know what? Oh, geez, that's already really dark on the Twitch screen, isn't it? I was going to turn that brightness down, but just make it spookier. But, I mean, you guys can already. It's already really dark for you guys. I'll leave it then. There we go. Okay. I'm nervous. Oh, that's haven't changed much. That's good. Break room. Data buffer. Oh, God. They're having a really hard time getting the doors open. Call Permaseal as many as you can. Rather than take any chances. Roger. Did you cut off the factory floor? All done. Should keep most of them out. I'm on my way to lock out the comp set. Just make sure to leave a way out of here. Trust me, I'll put you the data safe and sound. We just need to make sure we leave enough power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. See you back at camp. How do I do that? 
Oh, is that just doing this expected. again? They're having a okay. really hard time getting the doors open. Okay, I didn't realize that was just gonna do it again. I thought that was like I could activate it again to get something after this happened. What is with my vision right now, dude? Trust me, I'll get you to theta safe and sound. We just need to make sure we're leaving our power running so we don't have to return. I hear that. I don't know what it is. It's whenever I touched this to listen to the audio. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh god! Moira! Moira! The ceiling is leaking! We're getting the hell out of here! I don't know, I feel like I'm gonna be Moira in this situation. I just cried myself to sleep! And that's gonna be me tonight after playing this. Every night after playing this. Home is a state of mind. It, you know, home is also where you live. So. Alright. I'm scared. I don't think there's anything to be scared of yet, but I'm scared. Because. Oh god. Because it's a horror game. Horror games are scary. This atmosphere is kind of creepy, so. That's those two slots. Okay. That's cool. He starts freaking out when I look at the one that moved. That's actually really cool. I feel like that's going to be a fucking pain in my ass later, though. Yeah. Um, it's because... I, I guarantee it's because his stress is not supposed to raise or it makes his brain bleed. Um... So that's his stress level rising, which is a really cool feature they added, but it's really going to suck when I'm trying to hide from monsters. Let's see. Thermal plant this way. Oh, hey. oh that's, that's the tech depot. Okay. Okay. Thermal plant is probably yeah, it's that way. Locked. I wonder if I can swing this at it. Damn. Locked. No? Okay. It was worth a shot. It was worth a shot. Oh, uh, that means this way. This way. Also locked. Okay. So those are locked. We've been in. Both of these. There's something I'm missing. Like usual. big baby, but I'm really happy to be playing a horror game again. It's been a while. I need to find 20 bucks by the end of the month so I can get the Resident Evil Village expansion. those to work. Cut the lock or anything. I can't activate that at all. I hate that I miss the most obvious shit all the time. 
Oh, here we go. I've touched this thing. Hey, Uncomfortable you. breathing. Can you talk? Can you talk like the others? Why are you like this? You want some structure, Joe? Yeah, you do. So weird. Doesn't make any sense. I'm gonna shut you down now, okay? Yeah, you're creepy as hell. So I'm gonna. So the shut robots you can down. talk and have cravings. Oh God! Something banged. Making noise. Oh God, it's gone. Okay. Okay. This way. Oh, it didn't. Uh -oh. oh, it went through there. Okay. left bumper but it's right I do wish I could make this a little bit darker but that would completely negate your guys' abilities. Anything. Oh god. Like, when I'm looking at the screen right now, all I can see is the red light. I can't see anything else on the Twitch screen. It's really dark. That's kind of how I want it, like, to play, but... You know, I'm okay not having it that way if it means you guys are actually able to see. Because I remember the issue with Thief. And I ended up playing something different. Like, I put it down because you guys weren't able to see anything. That wasn't fair to you guys. Door, don't I? I'm gonna have to open it and then run and hide. Uh, why do I like these games? Is Helper Jane. Alright, now I need to get back to that door at the end of that hall. I have an inventory now. That's that's how I see my inventory. That's it. I thought it was like inventory screen. Oh, that's a that's a decapitated body, is what that is. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, somehow that's not increasing his anxiety, but okay. I don't know, I feel like that would make mine worse. I don't know how you guys feel about seeing randomly decapitated bodies, but 
That sure would make me nervous. I feel like he's going to die. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I got very um, alien isolation vibes from that. I did not like that. Oh, I did not like that. Oh, shit. Access denied. No. God, I've already committed to doing mood lighting for this game on Wednesday. Oh, I'm not smart. <laughs> then again, I am telling everyone to uh, to come and watch me crap myself playing this, so... I'm hearing noises. I'm hearing noises. Uh, no tool chip. Cortex chip. Ah, cool. Whoops. I know they told you that field technicians oh, how do you get full Sweet. access throughout Pathos 2. I'm here to tell you that's not Oh, they're calling happen. it Pathos? Don't get me wrong. I don't get not path way. Pathos? I guys to keep this place up and running, but there needs to be at least some level of security on like these things. I don't want to hear you barge into some quarantined area at Omicron and just knocked out the whole place with some virus. Omicron? Whatever the hell they're doing over there. This is what you can do. You'll be able to use it to open doors. Basically all of them. If you can't, there's something wrong or someone didn't want you in there. Then what do you do? You shove that Omnitool into a terminal and see if you can't get around it somehow. I mean, sometimes you'll need to get into places where you don't belong. Just find a way. You're an engineer for crying out loud. <laughs> what else? Take care of your gear. Don't be an asshole. That's about it, really. My name is John Strohmeyer, Pathos 2 security operative. I got an office at Theta. Come see me if you got any issues you can't handle yourself. Good luck. Alright, that was actually kind of cool. These are all the same. Update. This is really cool. I'm liking all these little systems. Toolchip security cipher updated. Because it's I'm getting. I mean, I know these are. This is from the guys that did um, Amnesia. Uh, but I'm getting very Alien Isolation vibes from how the systems are running right now. As far as I know, this game does not have combat. Just like. Um, Oh shit. Oh shit. No. No. Nope. That made me lose my train of thought too. Oh god. Um. 
She had, like, uh... It's gonna be more like amnesia than anything, and I get that. That's really cool, but, uh... Yeah, just, like, the systems, um... Like, having to upgrade the Omni tool and stuff like that. Uh, very Alien Isolation vibes. And with that freaking, Oh, that... Freaking ceiling panel he knocked down. Uh, straight out of Alien Isolation, guys. That, I mean... I'm ready for a fucking alien head to come down and just kill me right now. I, I don't like open ceiling panels. Alien Isolation did that to me. I do not like open ceiling panels. Oh. Hey, it's jump. Oh, God. Oh, light. Well, I'm underwater. Okay. We're underwater. It's oops a lot, not oops a lot. How does he not have horrible, like, crippling anxiety right now? That's a shark with things coming out of it. Okay, it's on the back. Like, nothing happened, everything still looks the same. All silence alike. Okay. Those are so, like, Frankenstein fish. Um, she has seven eyes. Six eyes. Whatever. I didn't actually count the first time. Okay, that's like right out of Resident Evil 4. Like, meets Call of Cthulhu. That's another one I need to play this month. Okay, back and different. Thick structure gel they can't shake. WAU's freaky fishes. And that's a chasm. Okay. What's a data buffer? So I'm in a power plant filled with psychotic machines. Okay. Okay. That said something. It said something and then it went out. Okay, it's not distance activated. Um, maintenance. Ah! What was that? Nothing good. Good, I get to crawl through the creepy bed. Into robot assembly. In the place filled with psychotic robots. Oh. That's what we're doing. That's a light. Um. Oh, it was in the van. Um. It was in here with me. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Red right one 
ones I can't do. Hmm. I am so tense right now, guys. Okay, so good. We have to go directly toward the the horrifying light. Good, good. Tubes are moving. Good. It's wonderful. Don't touch the structure. Gel leakage. Can't confirm its effect on WAU. She has been reported to S S E Walter. Hey, Robot, strange can you hear me? I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to kill it. I actually feel bad because, like, it, 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 it's almost like a person. Plug it back in. Sorry. I need it. Why? I was okay. I was happy. Um. just actually killed it. I feel really bad about that, actually. Uh, that was kind of rough. He's not even reacting, just... Okay. I got it. I got it. God, I'm getting smarter. <laughs> oh. oh, okay. Kicking tires and lighting fires, I guess. Lisbon, Portugal sta Station, Cadiz, Spain Station, Site Delta, Site Theta, all offline, but Site Lambda oh, is online. What, what's happening? Hello, is there anyone there? Hey, hey, can you hear me? I hear you. Uh, Absalot, what's going on? Uh, I, I have no idea. I, I just sort of woke up here. In the room right now? Uh, it, it, was, it was like a, a seat with a helmet. Is that right? Uh, what's your name? I'm Simon Jarrett. And what do you... Oh, so, damn relays. Where are you now? Uh, 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 some place dealing with electrical power. I I'm not sure if it's a plant or a transformer. Uh... Yeah, you're probably in a thermal plant somewhere. You want to go upstairs to the comm center. It's the room with the dome ceiling. Uh, hey, look, look, this place is not... There's something seriously wrong here. Hello? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. We lost another relay. Just listen, head for the comm center upstairs. I'll wait here. Okay, that door opened. That's good. There was nothing up there. Okay. 
falling hazard. Well, that goes really deep. With the tech we're seeing, I'm wondering if it, like, goes down to the Earth's core and it's bringing up magma. That'd be interesting. I doubt that's the case. I mean, I'm sure it's a much simpler, less sci-fi-ish thing. Oh, that didn't work. It knew. Uh-oh. Um. I hear it. Oh shit. Steam. I don't know where I do that. Right here, right here. Shit. <laughs> oh god. Oh my god. Lockdown proceed initiated to check terminal for details.
Oh god, he's dead? He's dead. 0722. Sunken. Did you get the final backup turbos going? Everything is wired evenly. We've hedged our bets as much as we possibly can. So that's it? Enough power to run Pathos 2 until the next apocalypse. We're ready to go. I really hope we didn't mess anything up. I don't want to have to come back here again. Relax, it's over. We're going to Theta. Maybe we should seal more blocks. I don't trust the helpers to let this place run in peace. We've sealed everything. Everything from the barracks to the comp center. If anyone ever sets their foot here again, they're gonna have a hell of a time getting a rock. <laughs> Secured. We've sealed off the factories to keep the light running. All superfluous systems are turned off. Anyone ever has to return? Know that the power flow regulator is hanging out by a thread. If you flip the switch, it's probably a no turn back situation. We're out of here. CRV7 black box in Coming into here is where we're going to stop it for the night. Um, we should be back tomorrow night. So um, tune in then. I will see you guys next time. And as always, I love you. Bye.